welcome to this tutorial. Today I will be showing you how to install a PlayStation 1 emulator called PCSX Reloaded on Ubuntu Linux. So let's go ahead and get started. First things first is we're going to open our web browser and hit Google and enter PCSX XR and under code plex just click on that and it should be the first link you see there so go ahead and click on it it should open the page up and once the page has opened up go ahead and click on the download section on the download sections you'll see a lot of files available on uh, they're mostly based on distribution and architecture so in my case since I'm running Ubuntu I'm going to click on the dev file and download um, you get this prompt just go ahead and agree to it and you should get the file once you uh, save the file go ahead and close this page out and uh, double click on it since it's a dev file what it's going to do it's going to start the Ubuntu Software Center and you can go ahead and install the package in my case I already have it installed so I will be skipping this step but in your case just go ahead and click the install button once it is installed you can see it under your applications games and you will see under PC SX and you hit configuration and you go to your plugins and BIOS um, depending on your PC setup, um, just go ahead and um, mess around with available plugins. But the X Video driver works best for me. Um, in my case, um, as far as the BIOS goes, uh, I can't tell you where to get one um, due to legal reasons. But if you have a PlayStation One console, go ahead and and dump it from there. If not, you know Google is your best friend. So I suggest hitting up Google. Uh, for a BIOS as well as a ROMs. So how are you going to run ROMs on this emulator? Well, if you download a ROM from the uh, internet, um, like I have, just go ahead and extract it, like I already have in the desktop. Once you open the file, you will see another uh, zip file there, and go ahead and extract it. Now, depending on the size of the file, uh, the size of the game, it'll take longer than you might expect, but um, it, it all depends on the size of the game or the file. Once it is extracted, you'll see a file that called data.bin.ecm. Now, we need to uncompress that file. And the best way to do that is with the ECM utility, and you can get that by opening Synaptic Package Manager and on your upper right hand corner on the quick search field enter ECM go ahead and download this utility it is a command line utility but it's very simple to use so go ahead and download and install it on, under Synaptic Package Manager so let's go ahead and close this up now I'm going to open up my terminal and I'm going to change to that directory on my desktop so the best way to do it is enter CD space and just drag and drop the folder onto the terminal and always backspace because it takes that extra space hit enter and as you can see here we're now under that uh, directory so you enter, you will enter this command um, so we can use that um, ECM utility so enter UN ECM data dot bin dot ECM as you can see there it'll start decoding the file and depending on the size it'll it won't it shouldn't take long it all depends on the file size as you can see it says done file is okay so once you see that go ahead and exit the terminal and go to file run ISO and go to where you save that uh, file and you will see it as a data.bin file so hit ok and that should be good now 
this pretty much says it all to install the games and how to run it on your Ubuntu box. I thank you for watching this video. If you have any, any further questions, go ahead and, and contact me anytime. Thank you for watching.